fault. I don't think it particularly harms it. It can enhance it. It can broaden one's horizon. And if one wants to be too rigid, 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 if one wants to be too rigid in the structures, right. then it can be, of course, harming. But um, in general, I would say it's not. Yeah, the, the, the way I make music, for example, is an absolute privilege. Mm. I've got this fantastic flat here. I've got, um, I, I live in a very nice place or nice part of the world. I don't have to um, think about a lot of things. Mm. But in principle, I think music can also take part in or take place in your head. So in principle, it's, it's one thing which really touches everyone. And I think in every part of the world, there's some kind of music culture so um and even like ten thousand years ago when we didn't have a lot of things we started to make music on bone whistles it's also fault the best time is now the 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 best time and there's a chinese proverb the best time to plant a tree is 30 years ago the second best time is today. I agree with that to some extent. Okay. I do think songwriting is some kind of magic because you or like I sit there with a guitar, with my notebook, with a pencil and an eraser, and then I I I, I play like the this chord structure or something on the guitar and then it just hits me and it's just like wow Th this the hook or something came and there is some kind of magic in it but i don't think that it's exclusive to a pro like elite club of mm -hmm. songwriters and and we're the only ones who could do it i think if you've got like like before, if you've got passion for music, if you if you love music, you want to create music, then you should do it. Yeah, fault. <laughs> <laughs> Thank so, you. <laughs> uh, one big hobby of mine is reading biographies of uh musicians and bands. Most of them who've done hard drugs. I haven't done heroin so i i don't know but most of them say you're just incapable of actually producing anything i i don't i don't agree with that because um even even people doing doing mariana or lsd to broaden one's horizon i mean travel talk to people listen to people uh that is also very much a horizon broadening and and i don't think yeah one needs that i mean i i'm was a, a great example for that i don't drink i don't smoke i don't do any drugs at all and it's been only very occasional exceptions to that in the past and um you like my music so that that must say neither. me neither uh false <laughs> okay i mean uh, thinking of the song, uh, sitting in my ya ya, waiting for my ya ya, ha ha, ha ha, that is such a great piece of music. Or uh, some blues, which is just clapped and, and sung to, is super simple. Music needs to be emotional to be good. Mm -hmm. And emotions can be very, very simple and very straightforward. Sometimes not. Sometimes they are complicated. And sometimes they are hidden meanings. And that music is still good. Like, also complicated music can be good, but also simple music can be good.